Hey everyone, it's Nassim. Hey, and I'm Josh Hewitt, Top Form Fitness. A uh, good maybe three, four weeks ago, I spoke with Josh and we wanted to do a 10,000 calorie challenge, see if we could take 10,000 calories in one day. And of course, I accepted this challenge because, you know, the challenge for me is to not eat 10,000 calories. Pretty much going back and forth what day we want to do it and just what kind of foods we wanted to eat every Josh had his food that he wanted I had mine that we that I wanted so we just started throwing them putting them together and we tried to add them up to see how much we could get to to put as much as we can yeah so this is some of the food we're also gonna go for wings uh, we decided on two big massive meals uh, as well as some like uh, intro workout snacks we're planning to do a quick strongman workout in the morning before we start hitting the really big foods and then another workout later on to just hit the gun show. For the pulp. So uh, basically, we're doing this for shits and giggles. This is for fun, but there's also some learning to be had behind here. So for those guys that say they're hard gainers or I just can't get the calories in, it's all about planning ahead. Yeah, exactly. So everyone who always tells me, oh, I can't gain weight, it's so hard to gain weight. They don't realize how much food you got to really eat to put on the weight. Just really high dense high calorie foods get it get you where you need to be hit your protein numbers but then it's calories you gotta look for caloric dense foods foods that aren't gonna make you feel full right away before you hit the caloric number now you don't have to hit 10,000 calories if you're trying to bulk but this is just a demonstration that hey it's not that hard to actually get 10,000 calories in a day and exactly like Josh is saying if you're trying to gain weight 3,000 to 4,000 calories is more than enough we're doing almost triple that in one day, so there's really no excuse to not be getting those calories in. This is pretty much our way of cheating and just having all the foods that we like to have on a regular basis on in just excessive amounts. Alright, should we start with the bacon? Bacon and eggs, baby! Bacon and eggs. Mmm, mmm. Does somebody smell bacon? So Nassim and I are splitting a dozen eggs and a full pack of bacon between us. That's about, that's over 400 calories worth of eggs each and over 300 calories of bacon for each of us. So it's not a lot, but it's enough to help us start getting our bloat on and fuel us for our upcoming workouts. By the way, one tip guys, don't cook bacon naked. Trust me, learn the hard way. Mm. Yeah, don't waste any of that bacon fat. Food porn, baby. Get our first pre-workout meal, bacon and eggs. I think this is like the perfect food, actually. Not about half. Yeah, sure. We can take a little more if you want. No? Oh, yeah. Seven of these each, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. This is thick bacon, too. Yeah, you're really good. Mm hmm. Workout. All right, we down those bacon eggs. Pre-workout meal. Gets a little energy to through the workout. Yeah, now we're gonna hit the super freak and power up for our workouts. You want a full scoop or half? Yes, yeah, full scoop. Okay. There we go. And uh, the nice thing about caffeine, not only is it gonna help pump us up for the session, but it also speeds up gastric emptying, which means It'll shorten the time before we take our next shit, which will help create a little more space for our next meal. All right, cheers. You got this easy. Go. Oh. Nice. It comes a fact. It comes an internet fact. Holy shit, the pill is so much harder. That's a big one. Thank <laughs> you.
pound, a pound each. I'm disgusted. <clears throat> oh, man. We are just going to stay in, grill up a couple burgers. I've got burgers upstairs and family wants burgers anyway, so I'm going to grill a bunch up. We're going to have like a burger and a half or two burgers. That will give us our, our six to eight hundred calories. And this is it. Alright. Oh god. You did it, man. Here, cheers. There. That's uh, evidence that they're all good. Oh yeah. Man, these look good. But I gotta be honest, I'm not looking forward to eating anymore. Whew. Oh man. Oh. However, I gotta be honest. Meat does turn me on. Cheers. Cheers. Done and done. I'm very humbled. This is by no means as easy as I thought it was. That could have been my food choices, but 10K calories if I were going to do it in two or three meals? Uh -uh. If you want to do this, you've got to start at 6 a.m., get six meals in, break it up.